हेलो एवरी वन एंड वेलकम टू नीट मेंटर इन केस यू आर स्कोरिंग अराउंड थ्री हंड्रेड टू फोर हंड्रेड इन योर जी टीज और यू आर एक्सपेक्टिंग द स्कोर टू बी बिटवीन थ्री टू फोर हंड्रेड आफ्टर इम्प्रूवमेंट इन नेक्स्ट थ्री मंथ्स देन वॉट यू कैन एक्सपेक्ट इन द काउंसिलिंग एज ए रिजल्ट कैन यू एक्सपेक्ट गवर्नमेंट कॉलेज इन गवर्नमेंट एंड इट ऑल डिपेंड्स ऑन योर कैटेगरी ऑल्सो वॉट यू कैन एक्सपेक्ट इन गवर्नमेंट इन डी एन बी in nb diploma and uh, in case you are interested to go for private institutes or deemed universities then what you can expect and what will be your budget if in case you are very serious to get admission this year because it's neat pg and next year we are not sure whether it will next neat pg or next okay so it's a golden opportunity to get uh, for you to get a seat and if you are really serious about uh, preparation then you must have like end uh, result after the counseling in your mind in case you are looking for the private college then you will also have some option whether you are okay to go for all the states or you are okay to go for particular set of states okay so depending on that if you don't have any idea like in the particular sc score what you expect from the counseling then you won't be feeling very confident and if you feel like okay in the score that you are expecting to get in the uh, real examination in that score you are you can get the desired output like uh, these branches you are expecting you can get these branches in particular budget then you will feel very confident and that confidence will boost your preparation and you can score even better than what you are scoring now okay so this that's why this video is important so i what i have done between 300 to 400 i have segregated in four chunks 300 to 325 and 325 to 350 350 to 375 and 375 to 400 so what can be expected rank and depending on that in government college depending on your on your category what you can expect in private and deemed university and in which states okay uh there are candidates who are not feeling very confident about the preparation they are setting the target too high and currently they are not able to get the score even up to qualifying that's why they are so much demotivated and they will end up wasting their precious 3 months of time okay less than 3 months but if they know that okay if they have budget for the private college or if they can accumulate budget by getting loans and all i have explained the loan process also then it then you will be feel very uh, comfortable that in uh, by improving like 50 to 100 marks or so you will be in the safe zone to get a seat uh, what you are desiring okay so let's discuss from the beginning okay uh, so these are the open states so when i say open state these are the states where you can go irrespective you have done mbbs from there or not even your fmg still you can go for these state counseling you have to fill the form separately because there is not going to be common counseling uttar pradesh very important state because plenty of uh, private institutes and the cut off will be high uh, cut off will be low sorry in haryana also there are uh, say so many uh, institutes but uh, at the same time you have to uh, keep a look at the hidden fee because when you go for the reporting they ask so much of fee and during the course of 3 years they will ask so much of hidden fee that we will able to tell you once you subscribe to our counseling guidance and for that you can visit our website neetmentor.co.in or you can directly contact us on this number our call or through whatsapp bihar is also very important state uh, the quality education is there patient load is very good in private colleges in west bengal also few institutes are good and the best part there is there is nri quota you can go, you can go for nri quota in case you have budget and uh, in very low score just qualifying a score also you can get the seat uttarakhand you have two options himalayan medical college jolly grant uh, that's a very good college in rajasthan there are plenty of colleges the fee is on higher side but in low score you can get the seat there so either you keep like uh, high score or high budget in himachal pradesh there is one private medical college mmu solan when you come to karnataka there are plenty of colleges and top colleges are there except the deemed university i'm talking about the private college where the tuition is fees very very low and in decent school you can get in case you don't get a dnb or you don't want to go for diploma you don't get government college then you can get a decent uh, very good private institutes in low tuition fee and there is you no know, hidden fee 
तमिलनाडु तेलंगाना आंध्र प्रदेश मध्य प्रदेश दीज आर ओपन स्टेट्स ओके नाउ लेट्स टॉक अबाउट द लोन प्रोसेस इन केस यू आर फीलिंग दैट यू हैव द ट्यूशन फी फॉर जस्ट फर्स्ट ईयर एंड हाउ यू कैन पे द सेकेंड एंड थर्ड ईयर फी देन यू कैन गेट योर स्टूडेंट लोन इन केस यू आर यू नीड लेस अमाउंट ऑफ money to uh, give pay three years tuition fee but if you need higher amount then you can go for uh, secure loan uh, based on commercial properties land house fds you can get uh, you can talk to the bank manager and you can uh, get an idea like whether you can get the loan or not accordingly you can plan so these things you have to do so that you are very confident after you get the score you can't change the score but now you have the uh, you can use your ability to change the score improve the score so that you are landing in the safer zone according to your uh, desired output first year fee need to be paid before loan is sanctioned and uh, in case you are targeting the private colleges then loan part is very important many candidates will go for loan to pay their 3 years tuition fee now if your score is between 300 to 3.25 then your rank is expected around 82 to 95 that uh, kind of like average depend uh, considering last 3 years it depends on the paper difficulty level what would be your rank in which score okay but now you can consider this okay in case this is your score then uh, in sc category uh, if you are bound to go for government college only you don't have any any kind of fund available then you can get non clinical subject if you come from st background then in that category you can get anesthesia psychiatry ent in government colleges in case of dnb st sc category candidates will get non clinical subject and sc category candidates can get middle clinical subjects i have categorized the subjects into three parts one is upper clinical where radio derma general medicine pediatrics and of scanny middle clinical subjects comprise of branches like general surgery orthopedics Uh, respiratory medicine emergency medicine lower clinical like anesthesia ent ophthalmology psychiatry radiotherapy okay so i uh, i will be using the three words in combination of these branches when you come to nb diploma all the st category candidates can expect all the branches except dmrd and in sc category they can get lower clinical subjects in nb diploma coming to private college that's very important if your score is between 300 to 325 a plenty of candidate around 40000 candidates will be landing in the zone where their score is between just qualifying to 400 and as you improve the score the competition will also uh, reduce means uh, the number of candidates will be reducing okay between 300 to 400 uh, maximum number of candidates will be Uh, lying there, and uh, they will be also reluctant to get a seat because they have got fairly decent score to get a private college. Now coming to private college, uh, so in if you are looking for radio, dermatology, medicine, pediatrics, then your budget is going to be between like sixty uh, five, sixty uh, to sixty five or more than that, depending on the colleges, and you can go for like Karnataka open state, Karnataka open state, other quota. एन आर आई कोटा इज देयर इन राजस्थान मैनेजमेंट कोटा यू कैन गो फॉर इन मध्य प्रदेश एन आर आई सी इट इज देयर एंड फ्रॉम द राउंड टू यू कैन डू द काउंसिलिंग फॉर एन आर आई सी इट इन मध्य प्रदेश यू कैन गो फॉर छत्तीसगढ़ एन आर आई सी इट्स सो एन आर आई विल बी गुड ऑप्शन ओके सो यू नीड टू हैव द एन आर आई डॉक्यूमेंटेशन प्रोपरली डन एल्स आफ्टर गेटिंग द सीट एल्सो योर योर सीट विल बी योर रिपोर्ट दे वॉन्ट अलाउ यू टू रिपोर्ट in bihar state also you can go for nri seats if you are looking for middle clinical branches then you need to have budget uh, 30 plus okay states like uttar pradesh haryana bihar himachal pradesh pondicherry in pondicherry the fee is higher more than 30 but these states are important so what idea you are getting from this video that if you are okay to go for these states and your budget is also okay up to 30 and you are expecting a score between 300 to 325 then you don't need to worry you are uh, you are right on the target you don't need to always plan for 500 plus marks in case you are not able to score even half of that uh, then uh, you don't need to uh, get demotivated every candidate will have their different scenario okay and in the paid guidance we will tell you like what is the right way of uh, uh, path 
or counseling for you individually in case you are going for lower clinical then 20 to 25 per year if you have you can easily get the seat we have uh, uh, done the counseling for many candidates and you can check in the website testimonial section with the screenshot with the proof many uh, uh, candidates list you will find there in case you are looking to go for deemed universities which is mostly available in maharashtra karnataka tamil nadu uh, such a states okay then your fee will increase in deemed university also you will have to go for nri quota only for upper clinical subjects for any clinical, middle clinical the fee will be between uh, 35 to 50 lakhs for lower clinical between 25 to 30 lakhs so you can see the difference in the budget uh, around 5 to 10 lakhs uh, compared to private medical college so if you budget is if you want to save your money then you go for private colleges but there is no single private uh, college and every state has different private colleges so you need to decide like which uh, open state counseling need to participate because every open state counseling will have a security deposit and you will have like chance to forfeit it also. so you need to understand the rules and all such things clearly the counseling is really complex for neat pg uh, but that's how it is but if you want to do it in best way then you need to have all the knowledge and all the experience of doing the counseling if you don't have so then you can contact us in case need pg score is between 325 to 350 if you are improving improving the score by 25 marks then what are the uh, more options you are having in case of government college the options are going to be same in dnb also is same and enemy diploma also more or less same only now coming to private college okay the budget will reduce if you want lower killing the subjects states like uttar pradesh bihar haryana in rajasthan in west bengal uttarakhand see one college will have different fee it's not necessary in karnataka for all the seats uh, the fee is different whether it's radio diagnosis or anesthesia most of the college will have the same fee structure but in other states depending on the branches the fee will also change okay and uh, all the students are not uh, aware of this fact okay so if they are looking for uh, anesthesia or ENT they are thinking that okay the fee is going to be 25 only but in that college the fee might be 12 okay as low as 12 so you are like very much uh, that fee is very in very much reach within your budget but you are not uh, filling that option or not participating for that state because you are not aware of that information there are so many colleges and you have to filter out among those colleges you might be knowing the uh, knowledge or have an idea about the colleges available in, in your state or nearby state the candidates who are fmg they are not even aware about the private college in their state okay so that awareness and knowledge and fee structure hidden fee structure the process is very much important okay and uh, you need to have a little bit idea from now so that you can set your target score okay and that will boost your confidence level and it will uh, push your score even further than what you are expecting in case of middle clinical the budget will be 25 approx or even less than 25 20 to 25 in a state like Uttar Pradesh Haryana and Bihar you can definitely get a seat and we have uh, we have helped the candidates to get such seats uh, uh, from last few years okay if you're looking for upper clinical like medicine radio and dermatology then again for if you come under minority quota Muslim minority or uh, Sikh minority or Jain minority then there are so many options okay where in the list station you can get the seat and in the first round itself but if you don't come under any minority then you need to pay higher tuition fee around 60 plus in a state like you can go for open quota Karnataka, Rajasthan, MP, NRI, Bihar NRI okay in case of deemed university for lower clinical the budget will be between 25 to 30 lakhs okay for middle clinical is 35 to 50 lakhs for different colleges and you have to look at the department in the college how good is the department okay you are paying the tuition fee good but uh, one department might be good in that college but the other department how good is medicinal department how good are the surgical department okay patient load these all factors will play a big role 
uh, otherwise you may be happy for a uh, few days after getting the allotment but when you join you realize that you have done big mistake and that can't be uh, corrected in case you improve your score by 25 marks further and it's a landing between 350 to 375 then for sc category candidates you can get uh, non clinical subjects in comment in st category if you come then you can get middle clinical subjects in dnb category dnb uh, institutes for st category they can get middle clinical subjects and sc category will only end up getting non clinical subjects but in case of nb diploma in case your pocket doesn't allow budget okay then you can go for uh, all the subjects except DMRD in case you come from an uh, ST background for SC category you can get lower clinical subjects like uh, anesthesia, ENT, ophthalmology, psychiatry, radiotherapy. Now in case of private medical colleges the budget will uh, come down further. In case of lower clinical subject you between 15 to 20 lakhs okay you can get the uh, seat and in some of the college the stipend will be very handsome 60,000, 70,000, 80,000 if you go for Gujarat state but Gujarat is closed state and uh, only one deemed university which is open the fee is higher but they pay you very good stipend right now this year they are paying 83 something from next year they are going to increase up to 110 or 114 okay so stipend is also a big factor in Gujarat like a state if you come from, come from Gujarat 12 lakhs you will be earning from the stipend only so you can uh, calculate the effective budget so these all things are very important budget then effective budget and if you come under giant minority Sikh minority there are a few colleges where you can get a lot of benefit in terms of cutoff in low score also in the same fee structure you can get good branches in case of deemed universities uh, if you have uh, rank between 60 to 70 thousand then for the lower clinical you need to have budget minimum up to 20 lakhs per year for medical clinical is 30 lakhs per year whereas uh, in 20 lakhs per year you can get medical clinical subjects in case of private colleges so you, you can save like 10 lakhs per year uh, and for three years 30 lakhs but you have to compare how is the difference between the department in deemed university that you are getting in private colleges okay and if you find that it's not big difference then you can definitely uh, save 30 lakhs in three years so that's how the counseling matters you get a uh, good college as well as like cheap uh, option cheap and best for radio derma and medicine the budget will be more than 40 like 45 lakhs plus okay in the last section 350 between uh, sorry in last section is uh, 375 to 400 where the rank will be between like 47,000 uh, to 60,000 so in case you come from SC background you can expect a government seat in lower clinical branches and for ST category candidates they can get all the subjects except the radio and dermatology in case DNB ST category candidates can get all the seats if you have the rank between this okay that's the benefit uh, coming under background uh, reservation uh, category okay in sc category you can get lower killing subjects in dnb and government colleges coming to nb diploma nb diploma is also good option okay uh, it depends on like which is your dream branch you can uh, go for dnb pdct examination and you can complete your two years of uh, secondary dnb so for st category candidates they can get all the branches and in sc category they can get all the diploma branches except dmrd now coming to private medical colleges uh, the budget will be as low as 12 lakhs 13 lakhs 14 lakhs you can get ent ophthalmology uh, psychiatry radio oncology such subjects in bihar up in haryana in rajasthan in west bengal and very good colleges i have uh, i know uh, they are paying 15 lakhs including all the charges hostel charges and everything they are getting like 60 to 70 per month stipend and uh, in this uh, score range and the college patient load is very good it's as good as like kmc manipal but i won't tell you the name uh, because i don't want to ex um, like uh, tell you now okay so it all depends on your score and your preference in case you want to go for medical clinical subjects then in state like up haryana 
you need to have uh, 20 lakhs. If you have 20 lakhs, that's the minimum budget you need to have. Uh, and you can get the seat. For upper clinical, again, uh, minority candidates will have good benefit here in state where the minority colleges are there. Minority colleges will give you benefit, okay? That also depends on the state rules. In a state like UP and Bihar, all the candidates coming from any state, they will have the same uh, right on the minority seat but in case of telangana andhra pradesh karnataka they give the preference to their own candidate the state candidate first and then seat is left over then other minority candidates will get the benefit over it okay so for upper clinical you need to have budget 30 lakhs plus whereas in the deemed university you need to have 20 lakhs plus budget for lower clinical for middle clinical is 30 lakhs and 40 lakhs plus for upper clinical. I will create a separate video for deemed universities for different colleges because just getting a seat in deemed universities is not a win-win scenario because 50% uh, of the deemed universities are not as good as they are known. Okay, the tuition fee is high and the quality education patient load is also not the, that good. So you need to be very selective in terms of selecting the colleges when you're going for deemed universities okay so hope this video is useful if you so please share it and uh, like the uh, video and subscribe to the channel thanks for watching